hello youtubers welcome back to my channel in today's videos i will be saving some plants and unboxing some new ones so right now i have a lucky bamboo i got it at walmart for three dollars so you know i had to pick it up then i also got me an orchid because i really wanted some colors to add to my collection so let's go so first i'll save this bamboo i had just gonna put in some gravel and then some water so right now i'm just taking the this packaging and papers off and it's kind of hard to pull this out i don't know so i finally freed it up and y'all look it looked like they glued it down in there like i see why that rotted out because like why would you glue that in there like what will survive in that it's just like a lot of rocks and pebbles and like glue of some sort i don't know it's like a jelly i don't know so I'm just going to try to free it up, free up the dead one and save the the live stocks, <laughs> the live bamboo. And I never had bamboo before. So, I mean, I had bamboo earrings, but never a bamboo plant. So, yeah, like this dead, like literally wrapped around. Look at that. It wrapped around it. So I'm going to cut this off because what the entire hell is going on here I'm gonna unwrap unclaw you <laughs> and separate because it's like really nasty ew really nasty so yeah let me go wash these roots off and now they're clean so I wash it pretty well I'm just going to put them in the vase. I just got some gravel rocks. I'm just going to fill it up with some filtered water. I'll just be keeping this in water and changing it out weekly. And hopefully that will make it thrive. So right now I'm just filling the glass up with some gravel. And filling it up. Trying to get it down in there. Got to shake it. Shake it in there. Ugh. I'm trying to get that gravel down in there. Loosen it up a little bit. And I'm just about done. I'm just still adding a little more stones down in there. There you go. It looks pretty good. So oh, yeah, I'm about to get some water, fill her up. And then I'm going to set her aside. There we have it. Oh, I named her Miku. This is Miku. And now we're on to the orchid. And with this orchid, it's not bad at all. So I'm just going to take it out this sphagnum moss or moss that it's in and put in some orchid bark because it still looks good. I just don't like this moss that it's sitting in. So I'm going to change her. Yep, took her out, freed her. And I got some orchid bark. And I'm just going to put her in some orchid bark. Just filling it up. Like, this is one of the easiest repotting ever. And with orchids, they love sphagnum moss, and they also love the orchid bark. And so I didn't have any sphagnum moss, but I had orchid bark, so that's going to work. But I do want to get another, um, I do want to get another orchid because I do want to do it in sphagnum moss. So, yeah, more to come. <laughs> but I am just about done with her, like... Very, very easy plant. Very easy. Let's hope she stays alive. No, I'm just kidding. Like, I'm doing pretty well on my plant journey, if I do say so myself. And I'm just about done. 
And there we have her. I named her Gigi. Gigi the Orchid. And there she is. <laughs> And so, guys, real quick, I decided to let Mr. 1800 go. Like, this was fun. It was fun while it lasted. We had our little kiki, haha, -ha, pretty cool moment. I thought about even saving those pieces, cutting it up, but I think I need to let it go. See, let it go. It's done. Bye bye. <laughs> And so on this day, I received a package because y'all, when I was sick that week, I ordered like a lot of plants to make your girl feel better as well. So this particular plant it actually came with a heating pad. See, look, a whole heating pad. I was like, okay, a little special. That's sweet. So a heating pad, some plant care instructions. Thank you note, very sweet. But this is what I came here for. <laughs> let me show you a little something. But no, let me show y'all what plant I purchased. I think in all this week I purchased eight. Yes, eight plants. So, but look what I have. I have a string of turtles. So cute string of turtles. Like I'm really falling in love with the string of things. So I like to collect more of those, but that's what it looks like. I took it out of the nursery pot because it looked like it was busting out that nursery pot. So I want to repot it. But it looks so nice and so full. My little string of turtles. So I'm about to repot him. So I got me some cactus soil. And I'm just filling up a little bit. I'm just going to fill them up, backfill, backfill them up, make sure he's all nice and cozy. Oh, and then I also, I named this plant Leonardo. I mean, if you need a reason why I named him Leonardo, I mean, what kind of childhood did you have? Like... Get it together. This is Leonardo. <laughs> I should get three more string of turtles just to kind of like finish the whole Ninja Turtle thing. But that's no, lame. <laughs> Anyways, I like lame things though. Anyways, this is Leo. Leonardo. Anywho, so the next day I was, wasn't feeling well. Well, you know I wasn't feeling well anyways. My well, honey bought me some flowers. It didn't match my sweater that day. My little frumpy granny sweater. So I just want to... Cut them up. Prepare these flowers. I guess he said this girl's buying so many flowers. Let me buy her some myself. <laughs> but I don't buy flowers. I buy plants. Anyways, let's chop these ends. Scissor happy. Chop, chop, chop. Chop it up. Okay. Yes. And voila. Uh, yeah. Oh, rubber band. That's what it is. Like, let me take this rubber band off. Aggressively, of course. <laughs> and voila. So cute. Like, he knows green is my favorite culture. Like, I just, this is really cute and unexpected. So, I appreciate my honey. Very, very nice. My little flowers. So yeah, this is the next day. And with these plants, I got like six for like $20. So I had to get them. <laughs> so let's see what I've got. Cause it's like a box of surprise. So I got like six of them, like I said, and I really don't know the names of these, but it's a uh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Just kidding, but it's cute. It's green, it's random, it's cute, looks healthy. And this one too, it looks it looks like kind of like a pepperoni, pepperoni plant, the little foliage, but I'm not sure. But I mean, each of them does have their name on the little taggy too, but that's not important. What's important is a product. 
This is cute too. That was cute. I guess more so. This is like another, like a pepperoni type of plant, pepperoni plant. I'm just looking for something that has color. Like I really, like I said, I've been wanting color to my collection. So this is pretty cool. It has like silvery foliage. I like that. That's nice. And this is the last one. Oh, this one has, this one has the pink. Right, it's like pink in it. So yeah, here they are. All nice, took it out. Gave them a good little drink. Okay, so what we have here. On this particular day, I had went to Walmart, of course. <laughs> and look what I picked up. Oh my goodness, this foliage, this purple and green. I mean, it almost looks, sh it's like silvery, shimmery, silverishy. But this is so gorgeous. It's called a Transcendia, Transcenda Zebrinia, something like that. I don't know. But I love her and I will definitely be hanging her up. But first, y'all know I had to spray her down because we don't want no bugs. And then um, it was like wet already and watery. So I took the bottom off because I didn't want it to be like, want to breathe, the roots to breathe. So now I'm taking off the plastic hook thing that it came in. So yeah, I'm just taking these off because I'm going to hang her in my macrame. Macrame. I'm not really, I'm not good with these, these, these words. So yeah. Got my hooks, my macrame, and I'm about to put her in it. So yeah, I'm just trying to fit her in there. These things are so tricky. I don't know why I didn't hang it on something, but you know, I'm gonna make it do what it do. So I am just popping her through it. And if you watch this video this long, please like and subscribe. I really appreciate the the likes and the love and support so subscribe hit that subscribe button <laughs> but yeah All right, and she is ready to be hung in the window, and I named her Luna. So this is Luna. And there you go, my love. Okay, so this is my last package that I received this week. I needed some color, like I said, I'm looking for color. Here's all the instructions. This came with cute packaging, very nice and sweet. And they leave a cat sticker. So I got a little two of them. I got like two for 15, so I could not pass this up though. So that's is why I was ended up with eight plants this week because they were a good price. So anyways, I got me a variegated string of pearls. You see the pink? Oh, so cute. I love these pink. You know, I love my pearls. So this is like a pink and white and green. Very cute. And I also, I'm not going to repot these guys either. They're in good condition. She just said, give them a good drink. And then she's going to bounce back. So I'm just going to just give them a drink and set them to the side. And here is my other variegated string of hearts. Y'all see that pink hearts? Really cute. I love these. So yeah, my little plants. So this is Luna. Got her up there hanging nice to King Cairo. And I maybe Queen of Hearts. Name her Queen of Hearts. But y'all see those roots back there? Look at the roots. My propagations back there. Got Miku and my variegated, sh you know, string of pearls. Look at the roots, y'all. Look at the roots back there. And the, the propagators is propagating. And Slim is doing well. Lost a lot of leaves, but 
I got some babies coming. See, that's babies growing. That's another baby right there. So I ain't mad. I ain't mad. And then Gigi the orchid. Look at Even though I lost the other orchid, the little blooms over there, because I got her when it was cold. So, But there's a new one opening. So I'm not mad at all, Gigi. And Miss Pearl in her bubble bath. And y'all, out of those six plants real quick, why all four of them died? Four of them died because I sprayed them with the spray. And I don't think they do good with the spray. So I'm down to two. So what the hell? Anyways, <laughs> Bella. Bella is taking forever to push this baby out, but she's doing her thing. Big Mama Bella. And we have Uni. Uni has no pests. She is doing all well this week. Appreciate you, Uni, my universe. And Angelica is blooming so lovely. The twins are growing so lovely. I appreciate this. So thank you all once again for watching my videos. Please like and subscribe. Until next time.